Do you sense a rift in Pittsburgh? Kind of, and I feel like I don't want to go back too far, but people are going to go back to Antonio Brown in the Facebook Live from the locker room a year ago, and I'm not going to draw a direct line there, but it just seems like there is kind of one thing after the next, and especially with Antonio Brown, you know, one thing that didn't get a lot of coverage that I thought was really, really eye-opening from the preseason and, and from training camp was him calling out Le'Veon Bell on Twitter. I mean, that's one thing that we know guys don't do, right? They don't mess with another man's money. And when he said, we need you here, we need you here, when Le'Veon Bell was holding out, I think that probably rubbed some people in the locker room the wrong way. Now let's put on top of it, you had the Anthem debacle, which went every which way but right, and did not achieve the goal that I think Mike Tomlin and the rest of the team wanted it to achieve. Then you had Ben Roethlisberger come out and say, I wish that I would have been out there standing. You have Alejandro Villanueva saying he was embarrassed that he was the only one out there standing. And this is an army ranger coming out and saying he was embarrassed. I mean, I think that there are a lot of probably not hurt feelings, but maybe some uh, inconsistencies going on in the locker room that might leave guys sort of scratching their head. Yes, they are off to three and one. They play the Jags this Weekend, So that might get them all back on the right track. But let's not forget, Ben Roethlisberger said, and I don't think it was lip service, that he was seriously considering retiring after last season. And I'm wondering if they don't make it like Super Bowl or bust at this point, I wonder if this is, in fact, his last season. When you're talking about model organizations in sports, particularly in the NFL, the, the Steelers generally come up. So the, the turmoil, I guess, if you will, that they've been experiencing is a little surprising. Their best defense, though, is the record. It hasn't necessarily affected their play at least when it comes to wins and losses.